you've waited all week for it, and now it's time to wind down and chill with Grit Daily. Hey everyone, time to wind down and chill, and we're going to actually steam things up a little bit. We've got some exciting news. This is our 69th wind down and chill column, so of course we're going to celebrate and play up that number because, well, everyone knows, right? We're going to go there, but we're going to go in a classy way, of course. Nothing too far offside, so let's go. As far as music, well, of course, Brian Adams' Summer of 69 kind of sets it off, but that's not very interesting. It's totally predictable to use the number in a song lyric, so let's come up with something a little bit more interesting. For example, let's take a look at the songs that have 69 beats per minute. You'd be surprised how many of them are. Some of my favorites are here, like Tainted Love by Soft Cell, Missy Elliott's Get Your Freak On, and of course Adele, Make You Feel My Love, and then one oldie buddy goodie. Good Vibrations by the Beach Boys, and the song that everyone needs to hear right now, another oldie by Bobby McFerrin saying, Don't worry, be happy. That's what we need right now. Other notable songs by Creed, With Arms Wide Open, Fat Boy Slim, Praise You. See, you learned something already. Then speaking of learning, got an opportunity to talk about a new way of corking bottles. Yes, I mean, well, I don't really know anybody who actually has to cork their bottle once they've opened it, but hey. There's got to be a market in this for somebody because the team at Verdi Spumante came up with a way to help you sparkle longer. I'm definitely down for that. They came up with this innovative cap that's a little phallic looking and sort of in keeping with our theme. But for all of their Spumante natural bubbles, they've got this cap that actually preserves the bubbles for, get this, up to seven days. So now, in keeping with the theme, what wine are we recommending this week? Well, it's the Verdi Spumante Watermelon Sparkle Teeny. And if you really want to make it a teeny, add a little vodka to it. This bottle is priced under 10 bucks, and it's guaranteed to bring a summer smile to your face. As far as dining, well, we're going to have a salad that's going to put you in the mood. The magazine Cosmopolitans identified 29 aphrodisiac foods. You'd think they could have, you know, found 40 more or whatever to, you know, kind of go there, but they didn't. So if you make a salad heaped with walnuts, goat cheese, pomegranate seeds, drizzled in honey and balsamic vinegar, well, you've hit like five or six of the 29 they suggested. So it's a doozy of a salad. Now, speaking of, as far as movies, you've got to see 365 days. It has now made Netflix's top 10 of all time. As shocking as that sounds, that's not the big statistic. It's the only movie to have reached the rank of number one, been displaced, and then returned to a number one position. Now, the plot, well, is a thin, really thin. I mean, it's not really designed, you know, to showcase great acting or anything like that. It's all about eye candy. And translation, this really totally hot dude named Michelle Marone, who not only sings some of the songs, but, I mean, he's just there to be eye candy. And quoting a line in the movie, I mean, he was chiseled by God himself. And I'll just leave that right there, too. So if you're looking for a really good suggestion is to wind down and chill this weekend. Put together Verdi Spumante Watermelon Sparkletini, whether you add vodka or not, now that choice is up to you. Make a salad tossed with all kinds of goodies like walnuts, goat cheese, pomegranate seeds, and honey, and balsamic vinegar. Mm. Then you've got a salad to put you in the mood. And of course, you've got to watch 365 Days, which would pretty much be rated X-rated. I don't know why it's only an R, but there you go. If you had to check out what the hype is, now you know. Have a great weekend. Cheers. Follow us at Grit Daily on social media and listen to all of our podcasts, including Like a Boss on Spotify, Apple, iHeartRadio, or your favorite platform. For special guest submissions, email Laura Lynn at gritdaily.com.